this guy saw me, but I just, I really need to... I can't be there. Too much radiation stuff. Well, nobody saw that. I think this might be all of them. And it's like storming that weird storm again. Yeah. Ah, there we go. This is bad. Forgot it was heavily irradiated over there. I think I'm trying to go in here. Taft music box. This is the same music box I gave to Chan for her birthday. Oh. What's this? There's something clipped to the inside. Is this a bug? So, Tachana was under KGB surveillance. Why? What did they want with her? Hmm. Why did you come here? Uh, to gain levels. Recognize it. What? You wanted Who? to talk. Let's talk. Not with me. The old fellow wanted you to see this first. Okay. Out of time. How did you get it? Not here. Meet me in the building next door in a couple of minutes. Uh. This just keeps getting better and better. Okay. She's over there. And quantum traces of the portal generator. Hi. You must be close. Why did you have to come back? Up. Uh. This is not going to end well for you. Stop! Stop! Why did you have to come back, Helen? Does he not know where I am? Let's see what you're made of. Oh, I think he's stuck. Why did you have to come back, Helen? Okay, going inside a building's bad. This is not going to end well for you. Let's see what you're made of. I'm made of running away from you. Why did you have to come back? I'm gonna die in here. I I this so much radiation. I'm gonna die. 
Let's see what you're made of. Yeah, okay. Uh Uh Okay, let's see if this guy appears again. He probably will, but let's just see. I'm just I'm gonna try to stay hidden as much as I can. I detected the echo of a recent wormhole. It should lead me right to him. This is Damn it. Going to end well. So I think he just automatically gets summoned at this location. Right, inside buildings, bad idea. Move! Oh my god. I hate it when that happens. You just get stuck on small objects that Igor just trips on. Let's see what you're made of. I'm made of running this away, like it's Let's see what you're made of. I can't. I am going to die. This is not going to end well. Let's see what you're made of. Oh, this is just... This is a bad mission to be on. I need to build something to, like, this prevent is not going to these well things. Four seconds. This is not going to end well. Clear nano diamond battery level at fifty percent. Let's see what you're warning. Nuclear nano diamond battery level critical. Okay. Uh, let's use some heals. Let me check. Okay. Um, I don't have any calming salts. I didn't make those. Uh, but I have alcohol. So let's use this. And there's this. And that's much better than what it was. Right. Okay. I definitely need to be able to build something that will um, reduce their portal making ability. And did I want to build it here? Or did I want to build it on the other side of the map?
Right, and I ran a ran across some NAR dudes, so yeah, anyway. <laughs> I really don't even know where they ended up at. I just ran. I think I'm far enough away that they don't really care as much. Oh my gosh. I hate, I hate, I hate the stalker. I don't like it. It's not fun. This is interesting. One, two, three, four, five. A hunter went out for a walk. Suddenly a hare appeared and shot him down. Bang, bang. Oh, oh, oh. The hunter is going to going to die. He was crawling back home saying, bury me low and let me lie. What? Sure. Okay. Yeah. Fine. We'll just accept that that was what happened here. Oh. Yeah, this place makes what sense. Took you so long? Did the tiny dancer get your attention? <laughs> Old man said it would. Ooh, He's gonna how test are you doing you that? Before he decides if he likes you. Every fucking thing is a test with that crumbling fruitcake. But at least he pays well. Are you going to explain to me what this is all about? Captain Spastic said you'd recognize a big mm -hmm. fucking radar assembly and that it means something to you. Uh? Then he mumbled something about the Rat King and the end of the world, but I don't think he was serious about that part. <laughs> I came here to talk to the old man, not his errand boy. I'm going back. The fuck you say? You're a lucky son of a bitch. I'd mess you up, but then I wouldn't get paid. Now shut your fucking face and pay attention when your betters are talking. You've got a choice to make. It's easy. You can either use the detonator to blow this metal monstrosity to kingdom come, or you can use the other thingy to upgrade your PDA. That will improve the functionality of every scanner in the network. Why do I have to choose? Don't know. Don't care. I did my fucking job. Now you do yours. So, you want me to either blow up the Dugger Raider installation or take this upgraded thingy instead? I don't want you to do anything. I told you. You just listen. It's him. Personally, I don't mm. give a tart's fuck okay. what you do. My job here is done. Last piece of advice. This guy is crazy loco, sure. But there's always some kind of reason behind what he's doing. So, ask yourself, why would he want you to make this choice? Huh. Oh, he died. He died. He fell and he died. Uh... I think I'm gonna destroy the radar. Because it'll hurt the NAR, and, and NA- that is it, right, yeah, NAR, I think. Ooh. Oh, this is that- oh, I see. I'm sure this was the safe option. Okay. Right, so down here is where I was thinking on, on building some stuff. Because it would be difficult for enemies to get to. Alright, well, I can't think of anything else to do, so... Let's go. Da-da-da! Alright. Success. Yay, everyone got things. That's great. I 
And everyone gets food. For you, partner, of course. Hmm. I can't stop thinking about what happened to Anton. I know. I'm really sorry, Olivier. He was one of the good guys, you know. Did we already have and this chat? Friend. It sounds familiar. I can't help but wonder if we could have done something differently to save him. You know what I'm talking about, right? Hmm. Only too well, Olivier. Only too well. Hmm. Effect? What's that effect on him? I don't know what that effect was on him. It doesn't really say anything, so I can't figure it out very easily. Anyway. Hail and well, met, old chap. Well, now you're being Hi, nice. Hill. What's up? Ever heard of Pamir? Sounds familiar. Wasn't that a mobile nuclear power plant? Chernobyl on wheels, yeah. How cool is that? Well, doesn't sound very I cool know. when you put it like that. <laughs> Imagine this: a convoy of four big-ass heavy trailers, one with a reactor, one with the gas turbine, one with the control room, and one for housing the staff. Five years worth of fuel. If we had one of those here, we could power our base for as long as we need. Right. I remember now. This monstrosity was developed by the Belarusian Academy of Sciences Institute of Nuclear Energy in the 80s. Another fantastic idea that came to nothing. <laughs> and after the Chernobyl disaster, the people of the Soviet Union weren't so keen on gambling with their health. So they scrapped it. I still think it was cool. Kind of like in Mad Max. <laughs> Mad what? Anyway, don't worry about our power supply. I can always build more generators. Uh, sure. But I'd still take your noble on wheels over a dozen generators. <laughs> That's funny. Alright. Mikhail, you've been around. You could teach me something about perhaps of gathering and uh Perfect. Let's do it. Let's do it. We will learn things. Gather and supply seems easy enough, right? Well it's fucking not. You need to know shit. For example, herbs with large leaves can often be found in the vicinity of their smaller brothers, mm -hmm. or even beneath them. So being extra observant means additional stuff. Ready to put Uncle Mikhail's knowledge to the test? Okay, let's make a healing ointment. Oh, right now? You to find two mushrooms and two healing herbs. And because my time is so precious, oh, I'm giving no. you no more than 60 seconds to find them. Three, two, one. Ah, fuck it, just go already. <laughs> go fetch me some motherfucking mushrooms and herbs, Professor. Okay, things aren't so easy to find this time around. So we need mushrooms and herbs. is actually not not easy. Oh, there's stuff over there. Seconds left, Igor. Hustle, hustle, hustle. Let me through. I think I just have enough. I do it? Hmm, not bad, not bad. Let's work on the healing ointment now. All right, that's all for now. You just needed healing ointment, didn't you? Well, now I get more things, which is very good. Okay, do I actually get to keep that stuff? I think I did. That's cool. I'm thinking it might not be a bad idea to actually keep some of the uh, things on me next time I go out. Hmm. 
mostly because I need them for to to like put together things that will make the enemies upset with me. That's mostly why. Do you have anything Howdy, to talk Professor. about? Hi, Olga. What's going on with you? Uh, I just remembered something. I thought you might find it interesting. Oh? I was guiding a group of biology researchers from America a couple years ago. I showed them around the Red Forest and everything. They were taking measurements, and one guy told me that the trees had barely changed since the incident. Ooh. I hadn't really thought about it till now. But it really does feel like this whole place is a snapshot of the past, like a butterfly caught in amber. That's probably due to the radiation. It almost wiped out the microorganisms living on the forest floor. Yeah, that's There's that's a thing. No decay. So the trees don't rot like they normally would. I mean, they are decaying, but extremely slowly. <sighs> so it's almost like time stopped in the red forest after the explosion. I find that weirdly romantic. Not my kind of poetry, but I can appreciate the sentiment, Olga. Yeah, things only, like, rot if there are organisms that do that rotting, basically. Uh, not that things won't die, but, like, you know, if, if a tree were to, to die in the forest and there were no organisms around to, uh, eat it, basically. Um, like fungus, for example. The, uh, the tree would just lie there, unchanging. It wouldn't be alive, but it wouldn't, like, rot, really. It's interesting. At least I think it's kind of 